Good morning. Another morning out on the pond. Uh, it's actually my last weekend before I gotta head out to Lake Tenkiller for the Bassmaster Kayak National Championship. So this is my last chance to get in some throws and uh, catch a few fish. Uh, it's pretty cold, as, of course, this morning, but that's all right. We're still gonna make it happen. So anyway, let's get out there and see what we can find. All right. So usually at this place, I start with a jackhammer. And this is those ponds that I've been at the last few videos where the jackhammer just does all the work for me. But I'm gonna switch it up today. Start with a deep dab and jerk bait. I need to, I need to be trying a few different things here rather than just only throwing the, j the jackhammer. We actually got a little bit of snow yesterday making this post front conditions, which is of course less than ideal. This time of year you want to be more in a warming trend rather than a cold snap, but it's supposed to it's supposed to warm up today, get up to 50s, so I'm thinking I'll be able to get a couple to bite. I'm not marking any out here in a deep spot that I almost always see them at. So they're either, either in a different part of the lake or they're up shallow. So let's, let's throw their favorite jackhammer out here. See if maybe they're up shallow. Yeah, but I haven't headed out to the middle yet, but I'm about to. Oh, now I'm starting to mark something. When I win the lottery, <laughs> I got a $300 Lowrance hook too here. You think I'm? You think I can afford live scope? Big? Don't need it. Got one. Hopping the jackhammer off the bottom. Surprise, surprise. Alright, come here. Alright, to start. Is that a spot? No, don't have the patch. Not bad. Go on the board, get out of here. Right, right where I thought that would be, even though I'm not marking any. I'm not seeing any back here in this corner like I usually do on my graph, but I did not feel that bite though. That was one of those. Usually I feel the bite on the fall, I'll feel a tick while it's falling, but um, didn't feel that one. Just went to pick it up and he was on it. Water temperature's almost 45, so it's it's starting to creep up there. It's been between like 42 and 44 the last few times I've been out. So I just saw a heron back here. A heron or a crane, I think it was a heron. It looked like a blue heron. Those things have always been good luck for me. They always seem to show me where the fish are. If they're hanging out there, it usually means there's fish around. So if I get one back here in this spot, that's just gonna reinforce that. that herons are just my, my good luck charm, my fish finders. Well, look at that, I'm actually marking fish. You know, I haven't gotten a bite yet. The heron was not lying to me. There are fish over here. Now I just got to figure out what they want to eat. It's a friggin' perch. It's a big perch, too. Wow. 
No, oh, stop it. Look at that sucker. On the drop shot. Oh, hold on. It's a pretty fish. First perch in quite a while, actually. Jerk bait on the pause, pretty long pause for it. But. Uh, all right, back on the board. All oh, right, don't get my little fella. Treble hooks in the net, my favorite thing. This one's a little better. All right, all right, all right. I know, I know, I know. Get that out of your face. There we go. No patch. Freaking time. Get out of here. All right. Let's do that again. I felt a couple bites down there. treble hooks in the net. Now can we keep the treble hooks out of my hand? All right. Little fella. All right. Back in the same corner where I got a few jerkbait fish this morning. Um, it's been slowing down, but you know, had a good day, got a few, so I'm just gonna make a few more casts in this corner where I've gotten a couple. See if I can see if I can get one more, but if not, it's still a good day.